Welcome back to Love and Junk. I'm Laura. I'm John. <coughs> Start over. <laughs> Today we have a very exciting Cheetos edition for you. You didn't start over. <laughs> right. All right. Fair enough. Uh, this is Mexican street corn Cheetos. Mm, we've been looking for this for a while. We have. Here's what. We love Mexican street corn. We love all things Mexican. We like streets. <laughs> we love corn. We love Cheetos. What's not to love about this? Well, we'll find out. That's, that's our expectation. But there's something, you know, somewhere in the back of my head that's like, you're going to hate this. <laughs> well, we've had several corn flavored things recently that um, you didn't quite appreciate. Yeah, and sometimes when a company says Mexican flavor, it's um, <clears throat> too much lime for me. And I yeah. love lime. Um, I see a picture of a lime on the bag. Yeah, so like Takis, for example. Yeah, that, too much lime. Too much lime. So, you know, I have high hopes. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. It says tangy, spicy, cheesy. I only like... Well, I guess I like to tangy. Mm-hmm. Not too tangy. <laughs> Cheesy, yes. Spicy, no. We'll see. I wasn't thinking about the spicy. I was thinking about the liminess. Now I'm thinking it's going to be spicy and limey. No offense. Yeah. <laughs> I I I don't know. What are you? What do you think? What do you? I, I have no. What's clue. your prediction? It do you think you're going to like it? It could be bad. I don't. I don't know. I, like you said, we love Mexican food. Um, we've had street corn before. The street corn nachos you've made have been delicious. Uh, but, you know, I don't know. Being Cheetos, you just don't know how it's going to be. Yeah, and processed is never as good as right. regular anything. Am I right? So, we have high hopes because Cheetos is an amazing company. So, we're going to open these up and give these a try. While he does that, I want to say hello and welcome if you're new or welcome back if you're not. We try food, sometimes we do other things. We love to garden, we love to travel, we like to play games, you know. We yeah. love to cook. So if you're into any of that, please go ahead and hit that subscribe. Stop what, you, stop what you're doing and do that right now. Do it. Make sure you hit the little bell. Ding. So that you can be notified when our new videos go up. It's That's every right. single day. Every you just day. never know how much of us you're gonna see. Sometimes you see a little video pop up and you think, oh, there's Love and Jokes video. And then a little while later, there's another one. So, that. if the bell is turned on, you'll be notified each and every time. That's right. Okay, I All saw right. you already did the sniff test. Well, you, you can have that opportunity as well. Mm. But keep in mind, a lot of like mm. chips and crisps and different things don't, typically smell like what they say they are. Sometimes. Cheetos! Ready? It's got some spices on there you can see. Ready, steady, go. Definitely has a corn flavor to it. Which I like. Mm-hmm. Hmm. You do like that, huh? So, I like actual corn flavor. I don't know how to explain this, but I'm just going to use the words that I know. <laughs> corn fritters, corn bread, masa, like on tamales and all of that stuff. I love that stuff. But something goes wrong when you take like a potato chip and try to make it taste like corn. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Actual, like, made from corn stuff I generally love, which Cheetos are made from corn, so. True. So, there you have it. I like them. I yeah. like them way more than I fussed about in the beginning. You know, I, I fussed a lot about trying them, and I didn't really think I was going to, but I do. I like them more than I thought I was going yeah, to. Yeah, they're not bad. Uh, got a little bit of kick to it. Has a little corn flavor to it, like, I think, like, added flavor, you know. Mm -hmm. A um, little cheesy. It's pretty good. But the spice is not like over the top or anything. It's... And the lime is a hint. Yeah. I forgot about the lime even because it's just barely there. So 
you can tell it's there a little like it's almost like an afterthought like after you swallow it's a little thing but it's not too much sometimes when you try a snack like this that's the first thing you taste and then it's too much for me it's a little spicier than i would like it to be i'd like it tamed a little bit but it's not too spicy that i can't eat it that's so funny i'm like it's got barely got any spice to it <laughs> well cheetos are one of the treats snacks whatever you want to call it john very often pick sweet and i very often pick savory and i pick cheese popcorn and i pick cheetos and that cheese puffs and that kind of stuff yeah very um frequently mm -hmm. i i would say so i don't know where i'm going with that <laughs> i don't know either but these are like if we haven't mentioned it yet these are like the uh like original cheetos not the puffs right yeah you, the yeah. crunchy crunchy yep yep so i would say that they are worth picking up it's a nice balance of the different flavors yeah um does it say mexican street corn to you i think it does mm, nice i mean it's let, an homage to it let's yeah. not get crazy i don't like it better than regular mexican street corn which by the way i am really 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 hoping that john can have his first ever mexican street corn experience because there's um a new little activity in our neck of the woods and we're hoping to take you with us and mm -hmm. uh it's mexican street food so they gotta have mexican street corn right you would think so you would yeah. think so so we're gonna take you along with us hopefully Can't hopefully wait. this week next week very 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 soon mm -hmm. let us know oh i know what I, where i was going with that so a lot of times i pick cheetos that kind of thing that thing that i was talking about earlier i don't know if i would pick these over regular cheetos mm. but they're That's nice it. For oh, yeah. something different. I like the flavor. But you know how good. we always talk about a dollar in a vending machine? Yeah. I think I'm going regular Cheetos. Oh no. I might go with these. It's something different. You know, I yeah. like having a little change up. Yeah. <coughs> if you went to the store mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and you brought home snacks and we didn't talk about it and you picked those, I would not have hurt feelings about it at all. I would happily eat them. I don't think they're better than the original. Yeah. Anyway, it's hard to beat the originals and things, so you know. On a scale of hurry up, run, get more, which would be, you know, a five. Hurry up, and we have to hurry up and secure our little stash to a one, which would be these are going right in the trash as soon as we're done with this. Where do those rank for you? Mm, it's probably <clears throat> four. Yeah. Ish. I'm gonna say maybe like a 3.5. I like them yeah, better than. Yeah, I was thinking than, that too. I kind of like them better than than the average thing that we try on our channel. Uh huh. It's very well. So what I mean by that is a lot of times when we try a different potato crisp chip snack, and it's you know they're trying to do a different flavor. A lot of times I'm like, yeah, just give me original. Yeah. Uh, a lot of times, like when we're trying these things. Uh, like I said, like a five is that wow factor. Like you take that bite and you're just like, oh my gosh, that flavor we is have to so get good. Yeah, yeah, we have. To, um, it, that was not this. For but, sure. But but this is better than a lot of other attempts we've seen at a new flavor. Yeah. Cheetos doesn't come out with a lot of new flavors, so I feel like they no. kind of work. I mean, it's Cheetos, it's puffy, it's flaming hot. They have the um, another hot. They have like a jalapeno one yeah there's a jalapeno one i'd like to see them try uh, other flavors like um like some of the stuff we've seen from the uk where they've got like beef flavor and like and not know. just the uk one of the boxes that we got had puffs like this and i think the uk does too that had like peanut puffs that oh, you yeah, really yeah. Yeah, I like those, i don't yeah. remember where that was from we had one from south was... africa i think yeah and then when we went to aldi there they had some there as well yeah so yeah. and trader joe's and we haven't really like i said cheetos only has a couple of flavors so and cheetos is king here there's yeah we have store brands that try to knock cheetos off but 
Cheetos is king. There's not another this kind of thing manufacturer that I know of right. that, that is up there. So I don't know anybody else doing other flavors. But anyways, good job, Cheetos. Yeah. Let us know in the comments if you have tried this one and what you thought of it. Um, mm. I think we'll probably get it again. Not every time, but... You know, yeah, couple a couple more times while. maybe over the summer. This is the kind of thing that we're having a summer barbecue and we're going to have some people over. This might be nice to have for different Something people different. to try. Yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah. Uh, so if you're not following us on social media, please come find us. Our links are in our channel banner, the place where our pictures are. Yeah. Um, Instagram, I would say, is where we're most active, probably followed by Facebook, but yeah. we have Twitter and we have Pinterest as well. We also have a TikTok, which is not linked, but you can come find us there too. Now, if you love Cheetos, Cheetos which we do, good. or Mexico Mexican, I almost said Mexicorn. Mexicorn, that should Mexican, be a word. I think it is. I think that's what uh -huh. they call the little cans of corn that has like peppers and onions ah, in it. I think that's called Mexicorn. Yeah, I think you're right. Anyway, anyway, or Mexican street corn, or trying new things, or us, or the, the video. video. Give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps our channel when you do that. That's yeah. all we have for today. See you tomorrow. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.